Hi, this is Kevin from Kevin's Classroom. They have said show that acceleration due to gravity is independent of the mass of the object. So they want to say basically if, if you and I are involved and we basically have no, uh, we play no role in all of this. Well, let's have a look. I'm going to say, right, the mass of me and the mass of the planet. Okay, let's call this MM and MP, shall we? All right. Now, what we know is we know that according to Newton's universal gravitation law, the FG is going to be G, mass of me, multiplied by mass of the planet, divided by, in this case, the radius of the planet squared. We know that. Why? Because I am sitting on the surface, and there I am over there, and I have got the radius of the planet. That's as far away as I am, plus half of my height technically, but uh, I think we can ignore that currently. But we also know that Fg is equal to, this is my weight. This is also my weight is mass of me times g, g on the specific planet. Therefore, the two must be equal to each other. So therefore, I can say, right, therefore, g times the mass of me multiplied by the mass of the planet over radius of the planet squared must be equal to mass of me multiplied by g of the planet. And I find that then g of the planet is going to be g times, and look what happens to poor old me. I don't count at all, and I get taken out mass of the planet over radius of the planet squared. Isn't physics cool? Cheers. Have a great day. Bye, guys.